I'm Dave Martino from Martino Signs, and we're here in Yadin, Pennsylvania, right on the outskirts of Philadelphia, and we are the best of the best. The thing that sets us apart from all these other companies are we pull it all together. We put image and brand in places where other companies cannot. A lot of people joke about calling me the great Martino. The fact of the matter is, I back it up. These are my chilling glasses. I thought those were welding. No, wait, these are my chilling glasses. These are my welding glasses. These are my grinding glasses. Back in the 80s, I started out as a graffiti writer in my early teens. Something about writing graffiti and the fame and the rep and the popularity of having my name up on walls really turned me on. Some guys knew that I did graffiti and they said, we want you to do our sign. So I painted their sign and they loved it and they raved about it. One thing led to another and people were paying me to do this. So I started talking to a sign guy at a very young age and he said, come, you're working for me. Long story short, I'm 49 now and I've been in the sign business ever since. When I put my name up on a wall, it had to be the best, the most colors, the best style, the best graphics in the best location. I'm trying to teach my children. I have three boys, Steven, David, and Joey. And these kids, let me tell you, being raised by a single father, they're great, they're fantastic. Steven's 26. Safety is definitely a main concern out on the job site. David's 20. I pretty much do everything around here. I gotta get on the crew's ass a lot. I also keep fish in the aquariums. Joey 17. Ah, Joey, what am I gonna do with this kid? Call me off guard and I'm actually not even doing any work. Joey, at it again. Look how hard he's going. Well, what do you want me to do? They don't really get mad at me, even though I'm pretty terrible at my job. Joe, Joe, give me some water. It's not water. Thanks, buddy. So one of the benefits of having my children here with me and having employees that are the best of the best of the best is my kids are being mentored not just by me, the great Martino, but by some of the best people in the business. Pierre has been mentoring little Dave for close to six, eight months now, and he is getting an education that just colleges could not provide. It can't be Rob Mason. It's a Mason joint. It can't be Rob Mason. I don't know. Wasn't it, wasn't it Rob... Rabinsky, because okay. I called him R and R a couple times. Rob Rabinsky, that was his name. How do you spell Rabinsky? R O B I N. Yeah, that's it. Close enough. Steven's out there with Quinn. Quinn is been an installer since he was 14. He's 50 years old now. Me and Quinn don't always see eye to eye. <laughs> Get the fuck off me! Slow down. Settle down. Not slow down. Simmer down. Hot roast. He is very, very good at what he does, and. I'm proud that he's teaching my son, Steven. Fucking check it before they fucking take it. I make paper phone call and just fuck everything up right. It's hard to fucking read this, sir. Come on, motherfucker. So fucking tiny. It's so fucking tiny. Get all this shit together. So that's all I fucking need. It's the sixteenth of a fucking inch. Come on, fucking lock, cocksucker. Fucking tits! When I started this particular company, Lisa was sitting next to me in my living room. She did the books, she managed the taxes and the payroll and the da 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 da, all that stuff. And Nicole, yeah, this girl's got game. And she's another one, she'll call you on it. These estimates were supposed to be sent last week and I, this is the first time I'm seeing them. You gotta be there at one o'clock, it's 12.30, so you need to leave now. You're rushing me. I can let her run without supervising her. Yeah! Grab your phone! Who can say where the road goes? Where the day flows, only time. So let me tell you about Jen. I love Jen. I don't know what it is. Hello. Pay attention. Did I spell that right? 
Hello? H-E-L-L-O. Yeah. -L -L -L. Oh, oh God, I spelled it wrong. She is the apple of my eye and, you know, probably the best thing that ever happened to me and my boys. She's been a mother to the kids since, you know, their mother left us. Okay, so do you have to go to the doctor to get out of physical or like to uh, graduate? Or? No, we got a letter like three weeks ago. <laughs> so it was due three weeks ago or it was due the beginning of the school year? I don't know, I didn't read the letter. But she does drive me crazy. My God, what's what wrong? What are you doing? I'm making signs, that's what, what like, I do. What, like, what are you making? It's a sign. I know, like for, for what? Sign. She just asked the same questions over and over and over and doesn't stop talking when I'm trying to work. So you're like going to some strawberry festival or something? Like, when are you into strawberries? Why are you going to a strawberry festival? Like, what's the, I don't understand. Do you want to go to a strawberry festival? This car thing outside? Like, what's the deal with the car? When are you going to finish that car? How long are you going to be working for? I'm done. When? When are you going to be done? Like, what time? Do you have a time? When are you going to be done? So you don't know what time you're going to be done? God, woman, just please. Stop calling me woman. You never know what you're going to see, and you never know what you're going to do when you come to work here. It's always something different.